Am I giving away too much information at the consultation? I love this question. I get asked this a lot by designers. Uh, and my answer to this is no. I like to give, give, give on my initial consultations. That's how I have a lot of reviews. And I want the clients to get as much value as possible for the time that they have with me. Now, sometimes it's a stepping stone. I'm getting to know them, getting gathering information about you know their lifestyle and to, to the idea of moving forward to ongoing design services. But sometimes it's a working design session and I will bring fabrics, my color boards, grout, examples of floor tile or backsplash. Um, and usually, you know, that's when a client is about to start a, a renovation or they're in the middle or, or just embarking on a renovation and they need this help. And so I feel you're always going to get the clients who were going to hire you and who see the value and are willing and able to invest in further services. And there might just be some people who also just know that they need some guidance and they just need a little bit of help from a professional. I love doing two hour consultations and I do not hold back. I mean, I do ask clients ahead of time to prioritize. We have three questions in the questionnaire. What are your three priorities that you want to hit while I'm there so I can be the most efficient with your time? But I don't think there's so much in giving too much away. You can't plan a full design. You can't pick specific finishes um, just there and then if you're just meeting a client. So that's my take on that.